The overall goal of this procedure is to use Raman spectroscopy to determine the nanoparticle size distribution in a fast, reliable, and non-destructive way. This is accomplished by first acquiring the Raman spectrum of nanoparticles of interest. The second step is to analyze the measurement data and locate the subdistributions in it using the multi-particle phonon confinement model. Next, the mean size and the width factor of the subdistributions from the fitted model are determined. The final step is to use the obtained parameters to determine the actual size distribution of nanoparticles of interest. Ultimately, Raman spectroscopy is used to show that it is possible to determine the nanoparticle size distribution in a fast, reliable, and non-destructive way. The main advantage of this technique over existing methods like transmission electron microscopy and X-ray diffraction is that Raman spectroscopy gives quick and reliable results in a non-destructive way and it's available on demand in most of the laboratories. Begin by synthesizing nanocrystals of interest. Deposit the silicon nanocrystals onto a glass substrate using plasma-enhanced chemical vapor deposition. Here, silicon nanocrystals are synthesized with an approximate size of 2 to 120 nanometers and a bimodal distribution in the ranges of 2 to 10 nanometers and 40 to 120 nanometers. Next, turn on the laser of the Raman spectroscopy setup and allow it to warm up for approximately 15 minutes in order for the laser intensity to stabilize. Make sure the laser and active lights are off before opening the door in order to be safe from the unwanted illumination of the operating laser.